Hello everybody, Stoic here, back playing Amnesia, a machine for pigs. Yes, why, Papa? Come and see! Okay, creepy children. Last time we were following... Oh, okay. We were following... Creepy children voices, and we were... We're an alcoholic, and we... Freaking... Have a shaky house. And we're reading notes, good lord. That voice on the telephone, we also were on the telephone. He speaks as if he knows me, and indeed I seem to remember him. Like a twin pulled away from the other at birth, I feel we are entwined, though I cannot conceive of how. I am a drowning man, ga grasping for the surface within my own house. Beneath me I know there are splendid architectures hidden in the dark that can only find the entrances. Hmm. Yes. Yeah, the, the, the phone thing that we were on was very cryptic. I don't even remember what it said. It was like pleasant eagle cactus fruit something. I don't know. Daddy. Oh! I saw that. I saw that. I'm not going that way. Uh-uh. Piano. Naps. Naps are nice. And you can't touch anything but chairs, and they freak the freaking heck out. <laughs> what the hell just happened? Shut up! Violin! Pleasant thoughts, pleasant thoughts! It's already going horribly wrong. Oh my god. So, I heard... Screw you, pighead! Um, is that a note? It is a note! Shla a what? I think that's German. I, d I don't read German. Um, so I heard a woman kind of crying and, and being stabbed or something. Um, and then clapping. I'm waiting for these flower pots to turn into, like, bloody heads or something. Give me a freaking gun. Another door. Okay, well, this way freaked me out a lot more than the child running in the corner view. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go this way first. Thank you. Is this the front door? Can I leave? Of course not. Can't leave my own frickin' house. Seriously. Alka frickin' holic. All this, gosh, man. Another one of these. I must say, my dear man, you, you look awful. Oh, yes, thanks. I seem to have picked up something rather nasty in Mexico. Mexico. I do understand what you've been through. A lesser man would have crumbled, yet you have made all of this. Oh, your yes. great factory, your charities. It is a wonder for one man and It will all be made clear, Professor. But first, a drink. If you're like Alexander and you offer wine, prepare to not be so pleasant. Okay, I don't like long hallways. Really, really don't. Picture. Mm. More telephone. Fine. Mandus, do you know me? No. Who are you? Where are my children? Trapped, Mandus. Far below us. The machine is fouled. It is breached. It is flooded. The bulkheads are down. The children are engaged. If you help me, I can help you release them. Restore the power, Mandus. Drain the flooding and restart the great engines. How? Where should I go? Hello? Hello? I'm very casual about all this, Mr. Talking Box Face Man. 
Freaking A. Okay. I think this is just... Yeah, this room again. I really don't know where I'm going. Let's try this room. That's outside. Huh, that's different. Okay. For some reason that kind of made me relax a little bit. I'm not looking at that. Plant. All the way. This is huge. There's a lot going on here. Bear rug. Okay. Hi. I don't think I want to be in this room. That's locked. Is that an anteater? A bear, a hippo. Stop, stop, stop it. Stop knocking. That's not a bear, that's a, well, that's a bear. That's a leopard or something. And it's a, what the hell? Okay. Okay, I'm, I'm waiting for one of these to, like, move and attack me. Very interesting. So apparently I can go outside. Though it seems like it would be rather limited. Oh, okay. Hold on. Let's go outside, I guess. Dude, you're outside. Fresh air. Don't freak out. No, it seems gross as hell. Alright. Is this... What? I think... Yeah, okay. So this is that hallway. But this one outside, too. Oh. Okay. This is closed off. Why are you giving me so many freaking options? I don't know what to do with options, man. I don't know where I'm going. I'm just walking around in circles. Okay. Another bathroom. Do I have a passageway to peep on people in here, too? Gosh. And after the party, she took my arm and said, But darling, however did you get from the trophy room to the guest's bathroom so quickly? Everyone considers you quite the magician. My darling Lilibeth, my father's house has many rooms, and as for mine, well, it also has its secret chambers. So, yes. Yes, there is a secret passage here somewhere. Oh, good. Oh, good. Yep, more peoples. God. So it said it went to, this one to the trophy room. I can't tell what's in there, but it doesn't look pleasant. Beds. Okay, I'm going to backtrack a little bit and go to that trophy room. Because, uh, yeah, hell no. I'm trying to delay the inevitable. Okay, nothing else in the trophy room. Oh, look, a bear. What? Oh. 
F and A. Alright, moving forward. Moving forward. What is this? Rubbish. I hear pencil scratching. And you. I don't know what that did. Okay. I presume it did something productive. I guess we'll go in butterflies. Um, I guess we'll go back to the bathroom. Do, do, do. Oh, when am I going to die? I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for my untim untimely end. And bloody, creepy caged room with a pile of something, and machines. Lovely. Oh, good. Dead rats. Even better. A broom. Damn it! I can't pick it up. I can't become Harry Potter. A saw. God. And turn. I don't know what I'm doing. Seriously, what am I doing? Did I turn it the wrong way? Do you want me to turn it the other way? Nope. Should I jump in? No. Well, now I'm officially lost. Okay, just conveyor belt. There is a hammer and a saw and doors I can't open. Alright, I'm missing something. Again, all the blood and the dead rats. I wonder if I'm supposed to pick something up. I don't seem to be able to. Nope. Okay, I have no idea what I'm doing. Don't give me this thing if I can't can't move it. Oh. <laughs> what is sparking? Why is something sparking? What was in there that left? Oh, I'm going to die. Now it begins. Vision fixing itself was weird. Why are the lights doing that? <sighs> oh, and the lights fixed themselves. Wonderful. Wonderful. I see a note. Did I miss that? We did now. I am to have a visitor, the distinguished Professor A. He has come to ascertain my mental well-being after my prolonged absence from the club. But I am not stupid. He is here to spy for them. When they stalked the Kipper, he was often called to pontificate upon lacerations in missing organs. And now he comes to me, to doff and wheedle, and my dear sir, and but you must still grieve, and perhaps just a quick look at your engines, the triumph of the age. 
He knows nothing of loss, nothing of sacrifice. But to refuse, that would simply poke the hornet's nest, invite a swarm of interlopers and thieves. I must entertain this buffoon and submit to his intrusion. Perhaps I should show him the tri tripery? See whether his stomach, so trained by rummaging in the innards of clumsily vivisected whores, is strong enough to stare to the real engines of his golden age. I may even introduce him to Jack, or his sons at least. We have stronger locks on the windows now, and we bring their toys to them. What? Don't frickin' like this. I released a beast. Hands are bleeding, raw. I scrub and scrub, but the smell will not lift. How can I hold my children with these hands now? How can I kiss them goodnight with lips that have issued such instruction? Don't frickin' like this. Okay, obviously I made bad choices. Again. These characters. Another note. Okay, it's a song. I'm not singing. I'm not even gonna read this whole thing. I don't... Apparently some of these notes I really don't need to read because one of them was in frickin' German and I can't read German. Okay. Dried blood. Newer looking blood. Awesome. I'm so gonna die. I don't know where I'm going. Mr. Telephone Man is most unhelpful. Was this like here, like this before? I don't remember. I definitely don't remember all this blood. Okay, I got it. Shut up. Okay. Can't die this early. That'd be stupid. Would not be proper. I'm not even in the machine yet. Or whatever. Freaking telephone man. Not helpful. Okay. Yeah, so this opened up. I am off the market. I will cry all the way home. You are most depressing. I will have none. I will have none at all. Wonderful. Great. All right, so I imagine we now... We're now going to die. We're now going to enter the machine. Or something. We're going to delve deeper. Maybe that's what those things did as they turned those ga oh nope well that's open now so is that why are these open now they weren't open five seconds ago gosh I do not like this it's coming come on daddy it's this way mm. metal ticking as it cools and contracts this must be the strange machine my new friend told me of if my children discovered this place it is entirely conceivable they strayed downwards, delighted in their discovery. Very well. It seems my route is predestined. The descent begins. I was so happy when we weren't descending to places. Okay, conveyor belts all over. I'm so not liking this. I want to punch these things. Okay, so as far as I can tell, I don't really have an inventory. So is it... I... what? Okay, door. Oh, oh, ow. In the face. Oh, I'm outside now. I 
I'm not gonna like this. It's a bell. It's all my house. My house is freaking huge. Okay, locked. What else would it be? Okay. Smokestacks. Door. Sort of wagon. Right now is about the time that I'd say, let me the hell out! You people! You suck! Okay, you want me going that way. Very well. This. Come and see, Papa. We found an egg. A stone egg. A stone egg. A stone freaking egg, I'm sure. Tempo rising, and I'm trapped. <sighs> Wonderful. Oh, against the rising waters, curled into his cabin, he barely noticed the passing weeks. The swell nearly sunk her, but his fever kept it afloat. In the dark, his song glowing. I really don't understand some of the writing in this game. Okay, wonderful. Once again, I wake up with a pounding headache and trapped. Okay. That's not so bright down here. A note next to dead rats. I realize now that my fear of dirt stems from the disease I contracted climbing those lost jungle temples. It is as if those clean places so free of humanity's filth imprinted upon my soul and left it fragile to what I find here. Fear is what keeps us all in our places, and the fear of the flesh, the ruin of the flesh, is the greatest of them all. I am sickened, I am ruined, but I will build such machines to contain this plague and heal us all. A new century is upon us. June 3rd. A bit of time. Okay. I really don't know what's going on in this game. Seriously, why is my lantern suck now? Box. I need to work on these lights. Seriously. Come on, slow coach. It's this way. Slow coach? Out of freaking notes. Trapped! Was it a trick? That voice on the phone who seems so close to my own? Who seems to know me so well? Does he lead me for a nefarious purpose of his own secret devising? But do I have a choice? Even though his motives are unknown to me, I must find my boys. I will follow the machinery down to the very core of the earth that will lead me to Edwin and Enoch. Oh, that voice in the very beginning was a guy, and then not a girl, but another guy, but yeah, got it. Another telephone. This is getting rather strange. The shaking ground you feel is our attempts to clear the flood waters. Oh. Treachery, Mandus. We were undone. Your children are trapped by this act. You must find them before it is too late. What do you need me to do? How can I find them? Always deeper, Mandus. Through the piston room and into the tunnels. Then find the bilge and flush the rotten water. I will help you where I can. But you must be swift, my little friend. Little friend? I, I feel like it was done on purpose that they made that a face. I thought a humorous face. Lights go out? I thought there were more lights around me. 
I hope he's not expecting me to really keep track of uh, what he's telling me. What is this? I can't tell. This looks like a battery or something. Put you there. But it was something I can pick up. That's weird. Okay. Oh my god, it's dark. Could you not shake everything then? Okay, that door's ajar. Oh, gosh. The lighting is so weird. I saw something. Screw you. Screw you. First I hear a bloop, and then I see a rolling barrel. And more bloop. Barrel, how did you roll? That is busted. Intriguing. The sap saboteur has been this way. The gates are far too heavy for a man to lift, and are instead hoisted aloft by a chain coiled about a tube that appears to be spun by motors connected to these electrical switches. Whilst the fuse is blown, the motor cannot be spun, and the gates will remain an impenetrable barrier to progress. Oh, so that was a fuse back there. Gotcha. Take this out. Boop. Looks like a closet. Oh, another fuse. More fuses. Okay. I'm guessing that's the gate. Why are there so many fuses? Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I go back this way and get the other one since it's a bit more backtracking so I might shut up bloop uh, another one truly bizarre why there are so many I do not know bloop like is only one of them gonna work or something Great to me. I'm going to close you. I'm assuming this is the gate. I don't really know. That's no, actually it's a like a or something. I don't even know where that is, though. Stuck? No, I can still move it, seems like. Huh. Okay. Well, this has been rather confusing, honestly, and I have no idea what's going on, what I'm doing, and why there's so many fuses. But things seem to be getting underway. I guess I have to go back that way, which I will do next time. So until then, stay frosty.